submit is a website. It's a website. Go to filmfreeway.com. It's the Green Woman in Film. And um, there is where you'll find us. And it's going to say open submissions. Now give us a chance to rest. We've got to rest. Now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, let's look at somewhere in um, August, maybe the end of August. Oh, absolutely. So why did you decide to do a film? Festival. We see independent film festivals all the time. We know about the jazz film, you know, a lot of the bigger ones. Sundance Film Festival is one I can think of. What made you decide? I'm going to tell you why. Go ahead. Because I think that the women can do it better. I don't think they can tell you. This is nothing against men. No, no, no. Don't, look, don't shoot the messenger. This is what I heard. <laughs> so, I'm thinking, so we have all these films with sex trafficking and things like that. And Okay. So now it's time for the women to step up and make those types of films because we can tell our right. stories better. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. And so that's why this is so important for us to have a platform, not for just local, but around our world. Oh, around the world. That was some amazing films. And your judges, how do you select your judges? And how, how are those green women in films? Uh, of course, we just go right to green women. Yeah. Yeah. So look at the camera. There is a woman that might think about wanting to do film and think that she cannot. Maybe she want to write. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's a young lady looking at us right now. I oh, will watch this later on and like, I think I want to do film. Speak to them and encourage them and let them know how brave they can be. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, yes. Yes. You don't have to know how to write. You don't have to know how to make a film. If you have a story to tell, that's all you need. Just tell a story. You can start with one sentence. And then you call Brilliant Women in Film, you contact us, and we'll take it from there. From, from, the, from the beginning to the end. You come to the writer's room, we set you up, you tell us your story, we go ahead and process, crack the process that, get your script ready, and then we, we, uh, we uh, begin pre production, pre production, and then we start filming your play. That's just as simple as that. You don't have to know, it's okay, we know. So leave that to us. We got you. Absolutely. Miss John Montreal, founder, visionary, actor, director. Many, many hats you wear, but most importantly, a woman that fears and loves God. A praying woman of God. So blessed to be connected to Miss John. Thank you for the opportunity. Can we get the governor? Governor! Yes! Call it. Please speak my face.
in the atmosphere where we are right now. Nobody's listening, nobody cares. And so right now, I have to bring the human side back to Texas. Somebody who cares about the people. I know what it feels like. I know what it feels like. And it's time for a change. We can no longer do this. It's no business for anybody laying on the streets. There's nobody should be hungry right now. Nobody should be starving. And nobody should have to be fighting for laws that we had already walked a long time ago for. Yes, speak, speak. To go forward and not back. Somebody talked about reparations and slavery. It's time for that to stop. Because right now, She's the governor head. has his foot on that head. Yeah. Mm. Wow, wow, wow. That was powerful. I want to let you know that it's awesome that you are doing something different. I believe the word of God when it says the first shall be last and the last shall be first. And in the season, he's separating the wheat from the tares. Yes. And we have an opportunity to put somebody in position to represent God and to represent us. And we need to be able to get out and vote for you. Not just in Houston, Texas. All over Texas. Because she wants to be the governor of Texas. Texas she wants yes, to be the governor yeah. for you in Austin. For you in Dallas. For you in Houston. For you in San Antonio. Yes. All the way down yes. to Waco, baby. Okay. Yes. And she's here to stand for us. So, Candace, can you tell us where can we find um, and support um, Deidre Gilbert for governor? You can find Deidre Gilbert online at Gilbert, the number four, gov, G-O-V dot com. And on all social media platforms, it's Deidre Gilbert or governor. And this is the thing. We need each one of you, not only to, you know, pass on the word, encourage the vote, you know, make sure that you come out and volunteer. Yes. And let's make sure she has all the resources and visibility that she needs yes. in order to heal Texas. That is our goal. That is our plan. So let's heal together. Yes. yes. I want to say that I did not even know, honestly yes. speaking, that we had someone representing us running for governor yes. in Texas. And what I mean by us, not just a black woman, not just an African American woman, a person with a heart. Yes. A person that's, Christ that's a Christian and that's out here fighting for us to speak for us, that's gone through some things, yeah. they can speak to some things. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. And I'm excited about that. Yes. And I'm going to do all that I can to help with my platform, Power to Us Radio, the Virtuals Hour TV show. I'll be back and forth from Atlanta to, uh, to Houston. So I'm definitely going to get with Miss Candace and my sister because we had an opportunity to connect and have us some good fun. It's just amazing how God does what he does. Yes. Yes. Listen, yes. listen, listen, listen. <laughs> Getting out the primaries is okay. first of all, I need to get out there. Okay. 